Hello everybody and welcome back to Skyrim, a modded version. Um, right, we're on the start screen mainly because I've come to the decision that since I've now got over 18 mods installed, that I'll try the a new one, which is start in a new area. It's the alter alternate start to Skyrim, this uh, mod. So I thought we'd give that a try. Um, got various new mods installed, uh, 100 times weight, uh, we've got a gold spell. I'm hoping it all works on this particular one. I've not tried this before, this alternate start. This is brand new install of this mod, so I'm hoping it works. I've got no idea what's coming. I've not watched any videos on it. All I know is it's an alternate start. So without further ado, let's have a quick look, shall we? New. Let's see if it works, first of all. Level 1. Okay, straight into the character creation then. Um, race. As you can see there, we've got a couple of extra ones there. We've got the Succubus and the Temptress. Hmm. Um... Once you descend into the Nords, blessed by one of the divines, a goddess devoutly devoted to women and no other, granted to select a few beauty and magical power, they are known as temptresses, and they are feared and respected by all Tamriel. Their seductive charm cannot be resisted. But I think I think they're also a race in the game as well that you can get followers as. So I think I might stick stick as a man. I have got another save that is a, a succubus. So. At some point, I might let you have a quick look at that. Um, but I think we'll go back to the old grey. No, I should be doing odd. Two-handed, no, I don't want two-handed. Britain, Conjuration, Red Guard. One-handed, we'll go back to the Red Guard. And you can see there's all different, uh, the character model is completely different as well. Uh, right, here we go. This could take a while. Almost have to speed through it. We're going to leave him as male. All right, let's have a look at the presets. What we can use to make our character. Oops, what have I done there? That as a basis, you think? We've done it again. <laughs> no, I don't like that one. Mm, no. Let's use that as the preset. The preset we can work off that. I'm sure we can. Skin tone. I want it pretty pale. I think. There we go, that's alright. Wait, let's stick a bit of weight on him. Zoom out a little bit. Let's get him up to, what, 80? That's a point eight. that sounds alright to me. Um, head. Dirt, non non scars. More paint. Next size. That's okay, that's massive. Forehead's alright. How's his ears? That's fine. He hits it. The first part, what's that? Okay, we can do that. Face. Enormous type. So. I think I prefer that. That's not I prefer that, that's better. That's more like my nose. Nose height. That's alright. Nose length. Seems fine. Not going to cheeks, nose colour, neck colour. Nose tilt. 
No, that's straight enough. I like that scar on his cheek as well. We'll keep that. Right, eyes. Come here. Eye colour's perfect. Eye shape. Oh dear, dear, dear. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wow. Oh, dear, dear, dear. <laughs> what kind of monster is this? That's all right, I think. Yeah, well, that eye colour, that's perfect. Do we want to bring them closer together? That's better. Right, brow. Stop doing that. Hi, oh, hi. Yeah, we'll take that down a bit. There we go. Brow, mouth, that needs to be changed, mouth shape. That's more like it. Hair, no, don't want that. Oh. Oh my god, look at that. Where's the hairstyle? There it is. That's what I wanted. Hair colour. Ooh, yes, perfect. Extra expressions, not going to mess with any of that because I don't know what it does. Done. Okay. All grey. Auto saving. Use the Mara statue to choose a new life for yourself. Okay. Something I need to do first though. One of the reasons I'm doing this is the original save that I had. For all grey wouldn't it let me change any of these for some reason. Whether it was I installed it after I'd already got like level 8 or something, I don't know. But we'll put the sexy move on here. Uh, we want to... Dance of Death. General. Let's take the killer move chance up to 40%. And the decapitation chance, let's put that up to 30, shall we? Because these are all new settings that I've not had before. <laughs> See, we have Sophia follower, a follower, uh, a succubus race, we can uh, change... If I think that's if we had a character like that to change the uh, horns and what have you. Uh, enhanced blood, immersive armor, simple knock. I've not done that one either, let's have a look. Base success chance. Let's put that up to 75%, eh? Welcome duration. 20 hours. Failure timeout. Put that to 12. Okay. I don't think we need to mess with any of the others. Alright, that's completely ruined all the immersion that we had. Oh, that's the statue we've got to talk to, is it? 
Oh, we're looking. Oh, we're looking. Oh, I didn't do his muscles, did I? Oh, well. That's to do with what you've got. Tweak follower, I did. Right. Activate this Approach statue, my child, and choose where your new life shall begin. Uh, I arrived on board a ship. I am the property. I own property in one of the holds. I'm a new guild member, patron of a local inn. Oh, that's the vanilla star, right? Okay. Wow, let's give you loads of options. I am a vampire in a secluded lair. Necromancer, warlock. I was attacked and left for dead. I am a member of the Alica. Surprise me. <laughs> um, I, I quite I, I own property in one of the holes. That sounds rather nice, doesn't it? Shall we go with that one? Uh, Which property do you own? Wow. Solitude, Rift and... Oh, white, look at that. We, breeze on White Run. We can start there. Oh, does that mean we have to go all the way back? How would I become a... A Dovahkin? How would I become a Dragonborn? It's Falkreath. Wow, okay. Uh... Well, I like the idea of starting in uh, White Run. Even a modest existence is something to admire. <laughs> Use the empty bed to begin your new life. Oh, okay. Right. Well, here we go, folks. Completed a second chance. Started living a life. Begin your new life. Okay, that's the new um, search thing. Alright, sleep in a bed. So we start off with our own home. How does that affect the home that we can buy? And it is fully furnished. With an alchemy lab as well. What have we got here? Take those. What's that? Chest empty. Okay. <laughs> so, what does the quest log say? Begin your job. All right. Okay. Well, I finally done it. After saving up for years, I only to secure the deed to a new home. It took nearly everything I had, but it's mine. No longer will I have to put up with the bickering and fights against my family back home. I can find and relax in peace and quiet after a long day. Time will tell if I've made the right choice, but for now, I will enjoy the fruits of my labours. Begin a new life. And we've got to investigate Lost Tongue Overlook and Sophia's tracking marker. Okay. Here we go. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. <laughs> We've got no armor. How's our weight? Let's have a look at that first. There we go. Yeah. Thirty thousand weight. And we should have Oh, 
what did I just do then? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what have I done? Okay, I didn't know that was... Uh... <laughs> oh, dear, dear, dear. Let's put that to flames. Does that wear off? Spare me a few symptoms. <laughs> um, this wasn't the start I was expecting. <laughs> How do you cancel it? Come on. in your ears i asked what side you're on great new in town huh white runs got two. difference is the gray so i'll ask again gray main or battleborn long live the empire uh, okay let's see what we can do about this lord <laughs> let's load that okay and i'll change it right okay since I don't know how to get him off that, let's put that on there, that on there. Let's try this again, shall we? I suppose this is all the fun of having mods on. I mean, I'm level one as well. I'd normally have chance in the uh, the cave where the the bear is to get my level up to it, level six. So I've got to do that from scratch. But I've got money now. Huh. I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job. But don't expect a miracle. Okay, hello. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Thank you. Let's do this. Get some quick upgrades going. Uh, iron dagger. Okay. That's a decent weapon. Have you met my father? Not bad, but it's a little dull. How about... Hmm, plenty. I help... You think all... This looks good. You put time into your blades, they'll serve you well when you need them. You want to keep helping? How about you make some armor? Let's start by tanning some leather on the rack. Um, let me see what you've got for sale as well. Well, I think on. Let's take all this off you. Thank you. I'll take my leave then. Um. I 
hide helmet, was it she wanted? No. Across uh, some leather. Yes? I'm waiting. Ah, good. A lot of weapons and armor need leather for straps fitting. That kind of thing. Let's see if you can make a hide helmet. Here's the rest of what you need. Until next time. Hide helmet. I help my father in more ways than people. I should hire you to be my assistant at this rate. Let's improve the fit. Take this leather to the workbench over there. Okay, mm -hmm. easy enough, I think. You think all the counsel my father provides the Jarl is his alone? Hmm? You have talent. Keep working at your craft and you'll be a fine smith one day. Thank you. Why don't you keep that dagger and helmet? Maybe you will remember me when you're making Skyforge steel, huh? Okay. Right. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. Yes, I'm just going there now. Uh, need something? That's a follower, I think, Aura. You're someone who can get things done. Yes, like I'll come back for you maybe later. We've got small weapons as well. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Alright, let's see what army you've got for me. I could just make this or I could just buy it. What shall I do? Um, what's he got in equipment? Uh, crafting material. Take all this off him. And we'll see what we can make. Good doing business with you. Out with you look like maybe you need a new weapon. Adrian at her forge, just outside. The place is named after her. War Maidens. It's a childhood nickname given by her father. What I hear, she was playing with swords even back then. Anyway, our wares are strong and the price is fair. What else matters? That'll be the Jarl, Valbruf the Greater. He's an honorable enough man. Never done wrong by me or my kin. Things are tough for him now, I'd wager. What with the fighting and the dragons. But Valbruf's a tough old Nord. He can handle it. Mm-hmm. Right, let's see if we can make anything. Good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. More inside. Armor. <laughs> can we make any steel stuff? If we can, we can, that'd be ideal. stuff. Uh, no, it would appear not. We're going for iron, I think, at the moment then. There we go. Iron gauntlets. And we'll make some... What can we make? Let's see if we do some leveling up here. Hmm. 
Mm. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. More inside. Mm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything. All right, let's try and sell these. Where are they? Iron daggers, there they are. Get rid of those. Get on that. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. Twelve, that one. What's that one? Sixteen. I'll have that. That. That, that, and that. And that, there we go. All grey is reborn. I wonder where we can get to. Wow, okay. What's that there? Windhelm? Helgen? No. Okay, right, so we have to find our way back to Helgen. We're in Whiterun and we need to get to River... whatever it's called. River Oak, oh, River Mead, River... <laughs> whatever it's called. Um. This one quest we have here, though. What's that? Is that the start of Live Another Life? That one point then. Okay. Well, this should be interesting then. Okay, well, we've got an arrow straight away, so. This is for Sophia, I think. So she's around here somewhere. We'll tag up with Sophia, I think, and then we will probably end this episode. And you can let me know in the comments below if you if you would. Anything you'd like me to do, or look at, or go somewhere, or do something. White Run Stables discovered. Oh, look who's there. Oh. Now... I think I mentioned, or I might not have mentioned, I think I'll, I've, I've put at the front of this video a little disclaimer, 18 plus adult content, maybe. Um, and I think this is going to be the first part of it. She's looking a little bit... Yes. Oh, maybe she's not naked. No, she's not. Right, we're fine. We're fine. Hello, Sophia. Hello. What? Where am I? My head. Oh, it's you. I mean, what? No, I've never seen you before. I have no idea who you are. <laughs> it's not like I've been stalking you or anything. Not at all. Mm, okay. Wait. Don't leave. I I'm injured. Uh, yes, injured. You have to take me with you, otherwise I might die, and you wouldn't want that on your conscience. Yeah, well, that's because... Okay, fine. If you take me with you, I will make it worth your while. You won't find anyone tougher than me in Skyrim. Not to mention that's good looking. <laughs> well, you are quite modest then. Fine, welcome aboard. Haha, <laughs> you are so funny. 
I'm just being honest. And anyone who says otherwise is clearly jealous. Can you name someone better than me? <laughs> I didn't think so. Anyway, thanks, I guess. Uh, so if you are sort of tough and independent, then why do you need my help? I don't. I thought I would help you out. I didn't ask for any help, though. Well, I was hoping you would kind of keep me company. Look, I know it sounds weird, but it's no fun on my own. Uh, you haven't been you stalking me for anything. If you want, but surely you can at least give me a chance. Uh, what happened to your claws? What? I have no idea. My memory is a little fuzzy. If you happen to have any, I would appreciate it. Oh, and stop staring at my body. It's like you've never seen a semi-naked woman before. <laughs> So why were you out on your own? And why do you stink of booze? Am I not allowed out on my own now? I had a little too much to drink. So what? I guess I must have passed out. I hope I didn't cause too much trouble. Actually, I'm not really that bothered. What do you want me to take? I don't know. I'll just go wherever you are going. I will repay your kindness by fighting alongside you. Surely that's an offer you can't refuse. Are you alright? Of course I'm alright. Don't start fuzzing over me. I'm more than capable of handling myself. Oh, I haven't introduced myself, have I? My name is Sophia, but you probably already knew that. Oh, I haven't introduced myself, have I? My name is Sophia, but you probably already knew that. Okay, repeat yourself then. Quite well known in Skyrim. Although sometimes I'm not... Let's not hang around then. Do you have something to say? Um... <laughs> Here we go. Hey, but don't push your luck. What have we got? Have we got anything we can give her? Not a lot. Give her some gloves. Hide helmet. Miner's boots. Miner's claws. <laughs> Okay. Wow, look at all these options. Right. And I must thank Carpy DC for that. It was him that uh, pointed me in the direction of Sophia. He told me it was a good mod to get, so I got it. What do we need What's to talk about? Mind? I have an itch in a really inappropriate place. <laughs> I would scratch it, but I'm sure you don't want to see me itching my... Uh, never mind. <laughs> okay, this is going to be fun having her as a, a companion. Um... All right, then. Right, follow me up here. Let's get into the uh, house before we finish this episode. Go back to Bree's home. Oh, hang on, actually. We can... Just fast travel to White Run, can't we? Say, running up the hill. And she hasn't put the clothes I've given her on. Okay. Alright, we'll sort that out. I just want to set this as her home. What's on your mind? Let's talk about home. This place is your new home. Do you have something to say? If you say so. Doesn't seem to have anything. Okay. I 
I suppose I could give her her own down. I'll, I'll make her an outfit. I'll make an outfit for her. And we shall have a little surprise when we come back next episode. So, I thank you very much for watching, folks. Uh, this is going to be fun for me. And I hope it's going to be fun for you as well. Um, never started as a level 1 before like this. Uh, I've always got to level 6, like I said, before, uh, before I exited the cave. So this is going to be a complete new experience for me, and hopefully you'll like it. Alright folks, this is All Grey, signing off.